Well, new at five, eyewitnesses and surveillance video was not enough evidence to make a murder charge stick. Prosecutors just dropped the charge against Carlos Knight, who was accused of gunning down a Tampa father two years ago. Knight was expected to stand trial starting on Monday. So the question now with this dropped murder charge is where does the case go now? Fox 13's Gloria Gomez shows us how it all played out in a Tampa courtroom. It's a very good day for career criminal Carlos Knight. He just dodged a murder charge. We have Mr. Knight. This must be Carlos Knight. Is that correct, sir? Prosecutors say they can't prove Knight fired the fatal shot that killed father of four, Adam Riley. Prosecutors say on October 2nd of 2020, Knight got into a heated confrontation with Riley and others at the Bellamar Apartments in Tampa. They say surveillance video from the complex shows Knight pulling out a gun. Mr. Knight is on screen. The other individual and Adam Riley are on the other side of the screen. Mr. Knight goes off camera and it appears as if a shot or shots are fired. Um, you can see at least one strike a pillar and a plume of dust. Um, and that is when Mr. Riley is killed. Witnesses say Knight fired one shot. However, several shots were fired that night by a second gunman. Prosecutors say none of the casings recovered can be linked forensically to Knight. And it doesn't appear that you know which caliber firearm Mr. Knight had and the other individual had? No, sir. And which caliber killed Mr. Riley? No, sir. Prosecutors had no choice but to drop a couple of charges, including the second-degree murder. Knight will plead guilty to a weapons charge. He also asked the judge if he could go home for the Easter weekend and return Monday to begin his sentence. Well, I really need time to all that situation. I out for a kid. I need a little bit of However, the victim's family strongly objected during a Zoom call. He's been granted more time on the streets for his family when we have a deceased family member whose four kids are crying nightly looking for their dad. The, his youngest child was a two-year-old that will never have the memories with his dad. The judge said that changed his mind. Knight was off to prison. Gloria Gomez, Fox 13 News. So there it is. Knight pleaded guilty to one count of felon in possession of a firearm, and under that plea deal, he will serve five years in prison.